Monday evening and we didn't have anything to do, so we booked tickets for the water bus to go down the Saigon River. So I figured I'd take you guys along with me. So check this out. I heard it's actually pretty nice at nighttime. So we took the 5 o'clock or 5.10 water bus. We're going all the way down to the last stop. You got our tickets? Yeah. Tickets were 30k, so about a dollar fifty to get there and back. So it's only 15k for one way. But we're gonna go there and back, and we're gonna catch the sunset on the way back. That's why we chose this time. And it's a lot cooler. This is the daytime being insane in Saigon. And we're through. I'm going down the ramp. We just saw the first one leave. I guess this one would be ours. It's a water bus. Now, they say this is used for actual transportation, but I'm skeptical. Because 4K to get on normal public transport, 15K for this, so it doesn't make sense. I think this is longer. I think this will take about 45 minutes to go, what a bus could do in 20. But we'll see. Got a little snack bar. <laughs> Houston got a TV. It seems like this would be pretty hot during the day. We can, we can, we can sit wherever we want. Yeah. So this is what the bus looks like. There's Melina. Huh? Huh? You guys will remember her from the Saigon devastation video when she gave me the Russian hello, the big old middle finger. Say hi to YouTube. Yeah. They love you. Does that Melina look nice tonight? So we're all settled in and we're waiting for a departure. You can see somebody has to sit there. What can we do? No, you can sit here. Oh no, I don't want to sit there. I'd rather sit by the window. Yeah, of course. Yeah. Saigon River looks like a nice murky brown today. Nice and healthy. This is full of trash and hepatitis. Might be a good day for a swim. So I was misled on Saturday. I went to buy tickets. And they charged me full price to go to the first stop. And then she tried to tell me, no, 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 it's okay. You know, you can get off for 20 minutes, you can go around, take pictures, and then you can catch the water bus on the way back. I said, that's not acceptable. You know, I, want, I asked for a refund. She said, no refunds. Even though I had just bought them 10 seconds previously. So we got her to exchange the tickets for Monday. And luckily enough, we didn't have anything to do this evening. So it's me, my girlfriend, and Melina from Russia. From Russia with love. You like James Bond movies? James Bond? No. No? You should. There's a lot of good Russian villains in James Bond movies. Are they sexy? Probably. Austin Powers' Ivana Humpalot. She was pretty sexy. In Russian movies, are there a lot of American villains? No, that's good. Not really. Who plays the enemy in most Russian movies? Russians. Russians? So Russians fighting Russians? Like war movies. This would be hot during the day. Almost a little stifling now. GoPro stick like me.
So while I was sitting here 15 minutes in the trip, I had this great idea to shoot this in 4K. So the beginning will be in 1080p, the rest will be in 4K. That's where they were going to sell us a ticket for the first stop. You know, we were supposed to walk around and take pictures for 20 minutes and wait for the bus to come back. And that was such a good deal. And we should not have been upset for being misled. Fuck back. Everybody's 
queuing up to get off the boat. We're just sitting here. Captain of the boat watching from the top of the deck. I can take a picture with you right now with the camera. I'm taking 60 frames every second, 4K resolution. Uh huh. about I just take screen grabs from this uh -huh. some of this video right here Wait for your no you big girl. I need to help her move her legs so we just got off on the first station right now and I did a bunch of screen or did a bunch of recordings for my girlfriend so I get some screen grabs now we're gonna hang out 50 minutes and we're gonna head back hopefully we'll see the sunset so far so good it's been pretty relaxing if you look over here you have one of those motorbike ferries give you guys a better picture of the motorbike ferry this ferry will take you and your motorbike across the river it's not for just your butts it's for your two wheels too i had to take one of these when i went to vung Dao because they didn't have a bridge built yet i think it was uh 10 000 to 20 000. i don't remember it's not significant probably 10 000. if anybody knows let me know this will be the first video I upload on YouTube that'll be in 4K. Well, you did not do 4K before. It takes up too much battery power yeah, and, and hard drive. I might start doing more 4K because it turns out that a lot of people watch YouTube from their televisions. Mm -hmm. And a lot of people's televisions are 4K televisions, like the standard, who buys a 1080p television. What do you want to have for dinner? Uh, Vietnam food. Vietnam food? Yeah. Like what? Do you want to eat fish food? Fish food would be okay. Well, it's for a long time. We didn't eat fish food. Yeah, but if we go somewhere else, I can make another video. Okay. There's our friendly neighborhood Russian over there buying something from the vending machine. Let's go see what she's doing. Said so she bought cookies. Oreos. Oreos. It's a lot of sugar, young lady. Girlfriend just had a great idea of getting there early so we can sit on the back this time on the way back. So let's get there early. Looks like there's already a queue right at the gate. This will probably fill up the entire back area. She's just now opening the gates. Now we're going to stampede in. Oh, my mask again. Uh -huh. We weren't able to get on the back. Three people too late. Not as crowded this time from the way back. Say 20% capacity. All the good seats are in the back and we weren't able to get one this time but we're going to try to as soon as they move.
did a tour down the Saigon River from District 1 to Tuduk. It was pretty relaxing. It took about two hours in total when you count the wait time. When you get to the end destination, having to wait to go back. Very peaceful, very quiet. There's a baby crying a few times. I would definitely do it again. So the pros, it was definitely very relaxing. The city is very beautiful at night. Ho Chi Minh City with all its neon lights and tall buildings is absolutely beautiful. If you're here for your first time and you want to see those views, I highly recommend it. The cons, well, there was a baby crying. I mean, other than that, there wasn't really any cons. It was actually quite relaxing. I would definitely recommend you do it. So that's my review of the Saigon water bus. It's only $1.50 for there and back. So it's not like it's expensive. So that's it for the Saigon water bus. It's definitely a unique experience. I would definitely do it again if I had the time. If you're here for the first time, definitely do it. Thanks for watching, thanks for commenting, thanks for liking. 